Hello, family. Thank you for coming over to the house tonight. And just kick off your shoes and relax your feet. Party on down to the SKB. We're kicking. Just kick it. Just kick it. Okay, you don't come to another episode where we're going to be asking the question of... Why are you telling my business? Don't be telling my business. Hmm. Why not? Because a can-can and a can-can, a can-can, a can-can, and a wheel. Now we're off to... Hello, family, and thank you for coming back to the channel. Yes, and I know you're saying it. What is she talking about now? She knows she don't need to be talking about nothing. And of course, my response will always be because a can can and a can can and a can can and a can can and a wheel. All right, we're going to be talking about Portia Williams. Yeah, and that's her mom. We, now, we see, we really do see where Portia gets her looks and trying to basically stay in the. Um, entertainment feel and only will only date wealthy people okay we're still trying to figure that out with simon <sighs> but you know i don't know <laughs> i don't know if it'll ever really come to true t or what's going on and all that good stuff but uh yeah and he's pretty much trying to let us know that he's in dubai Okay, he's over there with the sheiks and stuff. You know what I'm saying? They're sheiks like, you know, oil, oil, oil tycoon people. All right, so I don't know if he's over there trying to get his contract renewed, that they're going to send a petroleum over to him, or maybe he's getting the petroleum to take over there. Really don't know, don't really care. Sounds very boring. But uh, he made it a point to tell us where he was, okay? Now, I don't know if these are old pictures or they're uh, new pictures, and we're going to consider them re relevant. But uh, between Portia's Instagram account and his, they're trying to give us the illusion that they are in Dubai, okay? And they had enough nerve to tell us what they were eating, okay? I have no idea. It looked like beef stew soup to me. And then I guess that's uh, like they in Asia or somewhere. Uh, picking up the tea with the honey. I think that is honey. Uh, and I don't know. Maybe they went and saw a show that was in Dubai. I don't know. Because I, I want to say he's on a business trip dealing. But then again, we we just don't know what sign. But I do see them shoes right there. They ain't had no buckle to them. So he kind of listened just a little bit. But he had to let us know something that the billionaire Dubai, I, I don't know what the hell that is. That's a door and you go on the other side, it's a playroom. I, I don't know. I don't know. What What is he trying to say? Only the billionaire people can be there. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> but he got 4,867 likes, okay? But yeah, he wanted to definitely let us know that he was in Dubai. He is going around... Uh, like I said, I don't know if he's there for business because he, he could be celebrating his birthday still. Um, which is a piss poor way of doing things again by showing us everything about his life. Um, we think it's funny sometimes. He gives us great commentary. But, uh, yeah, I don't, I, I'm, I'm not understanding because he wants to show us that. And Portia wants to show she's still fine as, as hell and she can uh, seduce any man she wants to, Okay. Basically, that's what she's giving me. But, like I said, she has been dressing a lot better lately. Not like a, a skanky skank, uh, a guard to type of uh, dressing. She's trying to dress a little class. And, like I said, maybe. Because you see how her mama dressed, right? That's where she get her seductiveness from. So, it's all beginning to make sense now. Uh, got to use that body to attract the wealthy and influential people. It's pretty much what her mom has taught her and she's living up to that but hopefully as Portia goes alone and get a little bit more mature she can see that you don't have to flaunt your assets to get a man okay but uh yeah he look kind of ashy y'all don't I don't know what he doing oh he look kind of ashy up uh fella but uh he, he he's 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 in um some good casual clothing i like that i like i never seen that outfit and i know he just didn't buy the outfit just go over there to buy but no it's behind yeah he did he, he picked it up on the go um now i'm surprised he's not dressing in his african attire i guess 
how they say, when in Rome, do as Romans do. So I'm, I was looking for his, uh, his little sheet clothes. Uh, kind of like the Pope kind of clothes they wear around him. But, you know, uh, if you wanted to be up with the Arabs, I guess that's showing uh, respect and honor when you dress in their attire for their culture. And I'm thinking that's one of his friends that may live there or something. I have no idea. Because Simon just be pulling people out of his ass and, and making us uh, figure out who they are or try to figure out who they are, which we really don't care. Because we're still trying to figure out why he's still playing like he's a billionaire, okay? But most of the time, billionaires have their own jet. I mean, own plane, not renting or leasing. And they don't take pictures much and blast them on social media. See, that's what I'm saying. He's in that baby wealth stage where you could tell he's new money. He ain't old money because people don't want you to know what they got. They don't want the IRS to know what they got. And they have accounts that's over in the Cayman Islands, okay? Yes, honey. But like I said, um, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe we would never know. And it's no skin off our backs. But when he wants to publicize something... And I feel in the mood here and there, I might just go on and publish it. You know what I'm saying? Because it's getting tired. It's getting kind of boring to keep looking at his life and trying to live through it vicariously to see if we can find billionaire status over there. But we keep coming up empty-handed, you see. Because everything it seems like he does, he buys it. Uh, to show just like you know he hasn't gotten his blue check and he might have just gonna pay the two thousand dollars and make it happen Cause that's probably what nini did for uh mr scammer man shabba 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 you know him uh yeah uh she probably paid the two thousand dollars to go and get him verified because she's spending so much money on this man like he's been with her for an eternity but that's just them not us we're just over there looking in and making our own assumptions and opinions. That's it. Because that's all it is. Our assumptions and opinions. Nothing more. Nothing less. But uh, yeah. We can see where Portia definitely gets her. Uh, what do we call it? Scandalous ways. Her seductive ways. Uh, and that's because she was raised by Jezebel Mama. Okay. But it just is what it is. Alright. Like it love. We got to have more. You know what it turn in. Tune in to. But yes, that's Simon Gabalia. He basically want to let us know he's in Dubai. He has a wonderful, wonderful good old time. Uh, like I said, I don't know if it was a birthday retreat that he wanted to treat himself to. Or did Portia pay the, the fee because between her and Nene, I don't know who paying and who going. I don't know. I don't know. But I'm like, if you're going to pay for something like that, you might as well just uh, donate something to the homeless community. Because y'all both going to be homeless. Y'all keep messing with these men. Y'all keep taking y'all money out y'all bank. And they ain't replenishing none back to it. You understand what I'm saying? But it just is what it is. If y'all like it, love it. Gotta have more. Y'all know where to come. And I will try to keep y'all updated on the comments and goings on our celebrities. We love to watch. Okay? We love to watch what they were doing. And how they're doing it. And all that great stuff. But, uh... It just is what it is, okay? We'll keep on um, cranking out the videos for you all. We'll keep laughter in your lives. Because it's best to have laughter than go around angry all the time. You know what I'm saying? And upset and just overwhelmed, okay? So if you love my content, definitely share my videos. Like my videos. Those both help my algorithm to get out to more people. And definitely, if you haven't subscribed, what are you waiting for? Okay, what are you waiting for? Woohoo! Go and make that subscription to me. Okay, it's free. It's all just free. Just a little bit of your time to take out. Come over and get a little laugh. Make your day a little bit brighter. You know what I'm saying? That's what we do. That's what we do over here. And I will see y'all in the next video. Bye-bye.